Happy Sunday, brothers and sisters. You're welcome. You're welcome. 
You're welcome in Jesus' name. Greetings. Greetings in the name of Jesus. Our God is awesome working God. Awesome God. Powerful God. Nothing impossible for him to do. Powerful God. Hmm, hallelujah. Blessed be his holy name. You are welcome in the name of Jesus to another glorious service at his tabernacle. Jesus, thank you, thank you, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Holy is the Lord. Amen. You are welcome. You are welcome in Jesus' name. As you come, thumbs up, share, make comments. If you have not followed, remember to follow. God bless you. God bless you. Hallelujah. Love you so much, my sister. Love you, love you, my brothers and sisters. Mimo, Mimo, Loyua, Obatoga, Mimo, 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 Loyua, Obatoga. He's a great God. Hallelujah. Holy, holy. Holy, 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 holy is the Lord Most High. Holy, holy is the Lord Most High. Holy. powerful God that death could not hold him captive mm -hmm. the death could not hold him captive even in their grave Jesus is Lord hallelujah share. God bless you. If I share, share, make comments. If you have not followed the page CWPD, do where to follow. God bless you. God bless you. God bless us in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Amen. He is the Lord most high. Holy, holy, holy. children of the most high we bless his holy name hallelujah 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 he's worthy to be praised a god that even death could not hold him captive even the dead the, 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 in in their grave is still the lord he's still reigning in their grave while he was in their grave he went to hell to take the keys the keys of death from satan that he will not be able to hold his children captive. That his children will not be stuck in his plans. Hallelujah. God is mighty. Our Lord is great. Our Lord is powerful. The almighty God that came to this world 
as a human being and he demonstrated it to us that not even the death could hold him captive. Not even the death can limit him. Not even the death can make him to be stuck in the tomb where they buried him. Hallelujah. He woke up. But by the intervention of the Almighty God, something has to happen. <laughs> that whatever thing that will make us to be stuck shall be moved, shall be removed, shall be packed out, shall be uprooted in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. He died for our sake. And for our sake, he has given us the victory. He died very young that we will die old, that we will not die young, that the enemies will not have power over our lives. Hallelujah. You are all welcome. I am seeing some people here. Um, my minister of God, my minister of God, uh, yes, Marianne Osagbe Morue, Osagbe Morue, hallelujah, Osagbe Morue, yes, hallelujah. Some has rolled up. Ah, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. A minister of God, woman of God, Floxy Cell Section. God bless you as you come. Love you so much. A, a woman of God indeed. Great in anointing. And you are going forward. You are going higher in Jesus' name. You are going higher. The Lord will use you mightily. The best are yet to come. Woman of God, um, prophetess Evelyn Emmanuel, that the Almighty God is using mightily. We're packaged. You are packaged with so many gifts, and they shall all manifest in Jesus' mighty name. Keep going in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Minister uh, Itoha and Minister Itoha, God bless you, God bless you, God bless you, God bless you as you come, God bless you. I is the family, I is the family, <laughs> a golden hearted woman of God. Omoigui, Itoha, Omoigui, God bless you. God hearted woman of God, very kind, very gentle. The Lord bless you and lift you higher in Jesus' name. Uh, man of God, I buy on me, O Salome, say, Kalisto. God bless you, higher grace, higher anointing in Jesus' mighty name. God bless us as we come, keep coming. As you come in, do well to uh, remember to thumbs up, uh, uh, like, comment, and share. And share. God bless you. Thank you so much for your support. Uh, we are evangelists. Let us do the evangelism work together. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So now let us keep going. Let us keep going. We titled this message, we titled today's message, I cannot be stuck. I cannot be stuck because there are so many in the things that happen in the word of God and it is revealed how many things were about to be stopped. But by the power in the name of Jesus, by the authority in Jesus Christ, by the ordained uh, assignment the Lord God Almighty has come to do in this world, it has revealed to us that even though there is a, 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 a stage that things were about to be stopped, but no, God made a way and everything became victoriously. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. We are going to say one or two uh, word of prayer now before we go ahead. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Heavenly Father, we bless your holy name. We worship you. We honor you. We adore you, Lord. Uh, as we come together once again, it is not by our power. It is not by our mind. Uh, it is not because we are just too righteous or because uh, we can just wake up on our own. It is by your grace. It is the Lord that you demonstrated to us. Uh, it is because you love us. Uh, it is because you are the pillar that holds our lives. Uh, that is why we are able to gather once again in your tabernacle this evening. Eh? Father Lord, we thank you for this glorious service, O oh Lord, eh? because your glory shall reign and reign and rule in our lives today. Father Lord, we pray as we gather here that as many that are not able to gather with us, O oh Lord, eh? you know why they are not able to gather with us, O oh Lord. Father, we pray that, that as many blessings we are going to receive today, let them also partake in it in the name of Jesus Christ. Eh? We pray for your mercy, O oh God. Eh? Let your mercy speak in our week 
wickedness, O Lord. Eh? Let your mercy cleanse out, cleanse us from every unrighteousness. Eh? Those things that we must have done eh, unknowingly, or even those that we have done knowingly, are out of weakness. Father, we pray for your mercy. Cleanse us, O God, that the enemy will not be able to steal our blessings today. In the name of Jesus Christ. Eh? And we pray as many that have it in mind to come and join us, O Lord. Wherever they are, Father Lord, hasten their food, hasten them, O Lord. Eh? Hasten, touch their heart. Touch their heart. So join us. In the name of Jesus, eh? let your name alone be glorified. We cover our lives with the blood of Jesus. Eh? We cover our environment with the blood of Jesus Christ. Every power that steals away your word from, from, from the mind of men. Eh? Father, we arrest their powers today. We arrest their power right now that your glory shall reign in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to the Almighty God. So as we were saying that there are so many things that can make someone to be stuck. There are so many things that the enemy can just bring a situation for someone to be stopped. And we are going to start that. But we have to remember, when Lazarus was dead, and that is part of it, but let me just go through this one. When Lazarus was dead, and Jesus Christ has to wake Lazarus up from the grave, from the death. We remember that Jesus Christ commanded them to roll away the stone. He said, roll away the stone. Because that stone, even Jesus Christ can, can command that stone to be rolled. But there are things we have to still do to partake in that miracle that is going to happen. And Jesus Christ said, roll away the stone. Roll away the stone. But because if Jesus command Lazarus to wake up, eh, he will walk up, he will come back, but he will not be able to come out. Because there is a blockage. There is a stone that is keeping him inside. And because there is a stone that will prevent him from coming outside, Jesus Christ said, roll away the stone. Take the stone out of the face of that grave. Hallelujah. Every stone that is blocking you, while you are even in your victory, but it is not shining forth. Those stones shall be rolled out today in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. It is not that our prayers has not been heard. It is not that we are not praying. But there are some certain stone that is making us to be stuck. We are stuck in that place because the stone has not been rolled out. We are stuck in that place because the finance has not broken loose. We are stuck in that place because our the, the divine helper has not found us. It is not that we don't have the gift. It is not that we don't know what to do. But there are some certain things that has to take place to roll away that stone. What is that stone in your life? Today it has to be rolled away. What is that stone in my life? Today it has to be rolled away. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, every stone that is blockaging you from entering your, your peace, from entering your rest, from entering your divine purposes, today we are arresting them and we are commanding them to be rolled away. Be rolled away by angels. Be rolled away by our good, uh, by, our, by our divine helpers. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, every stock that you are finding yourself that you are stuck in a place that you don't know what to do. But mind you, the Lord has given us that victory. He said it is, it is well done. It was well done when the Almighty God created us in His likeness and image. He said it is done. It is beautiful. It is all gay. When we are coming to this world, God gives us different gifts for us to succeed in life. God cannot, does not create any human being without a source of living in life. Without giving somebody that gift that will make the person to operate on earth. But what happens? There are always stones. There is always this, this discouragement, this power say, that will come and put stone for you not to realize your, 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 purpose, to realize your purposes and uh, your destiny in life. But today they are liars say, because those stones are going to be rolled away right now. As we pray to the Almighty God, even while we are yet praying, uh, we pray that the Almighty God, uh, we assign angels uh, to begin to roll out every stone.
alone uh, that is making us to be stuck in one place? Uh, is it because of your singleness? Uh, that singleness shall give way today. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, uh, is it because you have not been able to give better uh, that, the, that your husband is using the opportunity to cheat on you? Today we are rolling that stone of barrenness. Uh, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, uh, is it because you don't have the finances uh, to do that uh, project you have to do, to do that business you want to do, to go to places you have to go. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, every stock, every stock power that is stalking you because of finances, we command that stock, be rolled away. In the mighty name of Jesus, I cannot be stuck. I can never be stuck again. Today we are going to decree and declare what is making us to stock. What is making us to stand still? What is making us not to move forward? That stone has to be rolled away. That stone has to give away. That stone has to give way. Because he has to listen to the word of God. And the Bible tells us, it says that whatever we decree on earth is decreed in heaven. Today we are declaring, we are decreeing that every stalking power, every stalking stone, every stalking situation that is keeping us backward, we command it to be rolled out. Of our, of our presence in Jesus' mighty name. We are moving forward. We are moving forward. Hallelujah. Let us see in the book of Matthew chapter 28 verse 1. What happened? In 28 verse 1. He said, now after the Sabbath, as the first day of the, of the week began, to to, uh, to uh, to dawn, Mary Magdalene and the other, other Mary came to see the tomb. And behold, there was a great earthquake. There was a great earthquake for an angel of the Lord descended from heaven and came and rolled back the stone from the door and sat on it. The angel of God came to the tomb of Christ. He rolled the stone out of the way, but not just rolled the stone out of the way. He sat on it. He sat on it. Hey, Rikaraba Santo Manderia. The power of God we sat on that problem. We destroy it. We arrest it. They will not be able to roll back to our way anymore. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. That way that Jesus Christ has to pass out. There was a great stone after he resurrected. There was a great stone. But what happened? Earthquake has to happen. What is the kind of earthquake that has to happen in your life? Who is that man? Who is that woman? that say over their dead body that you go nowhere. What kind of earthquake has to happen there? Is it to take away the enemy from your life? What kind of earthquake has to happen there? Is it to take those evil friends, uh, those friends uh, or, 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 or friendly friends uh, are, they the, are they the ones that, we, that, that God has to take out of your life? Uh, earthquake that has to happen there to uproot them. Uh, let it be so in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Uh, unfriendly friend uh, that will stand on your, on your way that will come and stand in your life. Eh? That will say you are going nowhere. That anywhere you want to go to, they will become blockages. Eh? Anybody that wants to help you, they will go and gossip you to them. Eh? Is that the earthquake that has to descend on them? Eh? That earthquake has to descend on them. Eh? Any kind of thing eh, that is making your life eh, to be miserable, that is making your life eh, not to be fulfilled. Eh? Earthquake of God. Eh? Earthquake of God. Eh? We descend on them today. We dismantle them eh? in the mighty name name of Jesus. Amen. Praise the Lord. And behold, there was a great earthquake. For an angel of the Lord descended from heaven and came and rolled back the stone from the door and sat on it. A complete deliverance. A complete assignment, a complete that the devil could not hold Jesus captive in the grave. Even in the grave, Jesus was Lord. Even in the grave, Jesus is still Lord. Even in the grave, he's still fighting for you and me. He went to hell. Take the key of pains. Take the key of death. Take the key of premature death. Take the key of, 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 of poverty. Take the keys of shame and disgrace for you and I. 
For you and me to be free from the hands of the devil. Jesus Christ rose from the grave. When he rose from the grave, the heavens knows it. The God and Father knows it. And he assigned angel to go and roll back the stone. That stone cannot move forward with Christ. That stone cannot move forward with Christ. So that he will not go and blockage again and put his children into captivity and cause his children to be stuck again. He need to roll it back. Every stone that is before you, not to come out of that same circle of problem, that same circle that you are passing through, that if the account is not empty, no more income will come in. Today we roll back the stone. We command that stone, get it behind me. Get out of my way. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, we are going forward. We are are not going backward. Anything that needs to get out of our way shall get out of our way. Whatever power, whatever problem, whatever brother, sister, uncle, anything at all that needs to get back, let it go back. We need to move forward. We cannot be stuck anymore. We refuse to be stopped. We reject to be stopped. Any unfriendly friend in our lives that is making our life to be stopped. Uproot them by fire. Market Father, we pray thee, O Lord. Let the thunder that we uproot. Every enemy standing at the front. Let that thunder come up now. Let that thunder descend now. Let that thunder uproot them. Dismantle them. Uproot them. Disgrace them. Shame them. Put them out. Go back. Makeriba. Let me pass. Let it pass. I am going to somewhere. Jesus tell the, 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 the power of death, let me pass. Because I'm going to somewhere. I need to reveal myself to the people. I need to reveal myself to the disciples. I need to reveal myself that I have come to take this, the, 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 the power of death, the power of sickness, the power of lamentation, the power of bitterness, the power that will make people to be stuck. I have come to take it from the Satan. Let me pass. I am going back to heaven. And I will send you the comforter. Let me pass. You stone. God sent the angel to roll the stone back. And the angel rolled the stone. He did not just roll the stone. He sat on it. That the stone will not be able to move back. Today, as the Lord dismantle, as it dismantle that sickness in your body, today, as the Lord dismantle, as it dismantle that shame and disgrace out of your life, it will never return back to you. It will never come back to your to, to your household. It will never return to your finances. It will never return to your health. It will never return to your process of life. It will never return to your glorious life. It will never return to your star. It will never stop stalk your star anymore. Your star will begin to shine brighter. Whatever power that has come to stand before us, that we will not move forward, that want to stalk us not to move forward, Masserekete, hey, earthquake from above. Marababakanderebosoto, earthquake from above. Descend on them now. Descend on them now. Descend whatever rock, whatever power, whatever thing that is stopping me not to move forward. I command that stone to be rolled away. That difficult to level down. That mountain crumble. I move forward. In Jesus' mighty name, we shall all move forward. We shall not be stuck anymore. We shall not be the one that they will be using to make a, 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 a story of ridicule. In the mighty name of Jesus, we are moving forward. Our husbands are moving forward. Our wives are moving forward. Our daughters, our sons are moving forward. Anyone concerning us, we are moving forward. We refuse to be stuck anymore. In Jesus' mighty name. The power in the resurrection. Resurrection of power. The resurrection power is upon our lives today. The resurrection power, we are the Easter time. And that stone that has been rolled away, that angel
Moses that rolled away that stone, that kind of earthquake that took place, and for Jesus Christ to rise again, let it descend on us, oh Father. Father, our God, our maker, let that same earthquake begin to walk, begin to dismantle, begin to scatter, begin to uproot, begin to amend our lives. Let it come upon us now. Let it come upon where we have been stopped, that we will come out of that tomb. Of that situation that situation that has been holding us bound that situation that has been making us to go the same circle the same problem repeating itself the same problem angel come to our rescue let the stone let the power whatever they have done in an evil altar Occultic altar in the covens, eh? whatever they have done at the junctions, eh? whatever they have done at their evil gathering eh? in the marine world, wherever, however they have done it, we don't care to know. Hey, earthquake of God, eh? descend on them, dismantle them, uproot them eh? in the mighty name of Jesus. Eh? Angel that rose away stones eh? from the lives of men. We invite you right now. Begin to roll away every stone. Begin to roll away every stone. Standing against our greatness. Standing against our purposes in life. Standing against our destiny. Standing against our, uh, 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 our elevation. That we don't want us to elevate. That don't want us to emerge. Send these stones backward. Roll it out of our way. And sit on it. And sit on it. Hey, Rikaraba, Iman Taraba Konduria, Shaka Lekete Kete, Iman Dorobo Sontoro. Anything good that we have in heart to do, eh, that the enemy has placed stone eh, so that we would not be able to do it. Eh. Maraboroko Sontoria, we command you to be rolled, eh. we command you to be rolled backward. Eh. Ah, Kete Rebo Sondo, roll back. Let me pass. Makerebo Santaraba. I katara katere kete. I mondo robo sonto mande keri alala. Ma katara katere bo sonto ni manakuraba saya. I refuse to be stuck. I reject to be stuck. We refuse to be stuck. You shall not be stuck anymore. You shall not be stuck anymore. In that position that you are. You want to do so many things. Eh? There are things you need to do. But something is stalking you. Something is not making you to go forward. Eh? Something is dragging you backward. Eh? Something is making you to stand still. Eh? We reject and we refuse it. Eh? We will not be stuck anymore. We will not be standing still anymore. We move by fire. We move by thunder. The earthquake will descend on that place. It will catapult. It will destroy. We will walk out of that circle that we have been. That circle that has been holding us bound. Not to move forward. We move out of it. We move out of it. We move out of it. Hey, Kerebo Santa, pandemic, you can say the moment ago, you are a stone in our lives. We command you to be seized. We command you to be seized in the name of Jesus Christ. Witches and wizards in our families. We are, we are, we refuse you. You cannot stalk us anymore. We command you to be moved. We command you to be rolled back. Pakareko to robo, Santa Ramana Kaimebo, Sierra. Wherever you have been called into poverty, any seal that has sealed anybody. That is saying this one will never succeed anymore. Today we cancel it. Today we roll back the stone. We command the stone to be rolled back. Because in the word of God, it tells me that whatever I decree on earth is decreed in heaven. And the word of God says, God said, command ye me. You need to make a prayer of commandment. Just command him. Command. You have the authority. There is authority in our tongue. Command every stone in your life to be rolled back. To be rolled back. Back. The power of God will stop them down. They will not be able to roll back to our lives anymore. In the name of Jesus Christ. Hey, this Easter, we mark. A new page in our life. This sister period, it will mark a new page in our life. That whatever stock that we have been, 
There are past talk we have to give up. We are moving forward. We are coming out of any bondage. We are coming out of any kind of bondage. We are coming out of bondage of limitation. We are coming out of the bondage of delay. We are coming out of the bondage of I don't know what to do of shame and disgrace. We are coming out of the bondage of limitation in finance. Hey, we are coming out of the bondage of not serving God fully. Just because you don't depression, there is depression. I want to serve God. I want to work for God. But there is this kind of depression. Eh? When you remember, ah, there is something I have to do now. When I go to the hands of God, people will shut me down. Just because I am like this. Eh? Those that look down on you yesterday, they will begin to look unto you. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Eh? Those enemies that you see, you will see them no more. Because we are marching forward. Eh? The resurrection of Christ eh, will prove itself so strong in our life this period. Eh? So shall it be upon you and I in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Manda kerebo santa. Ekeri kalabanda rabo santo. Ekeri alalanda kanda raba. Hey. Ekeri alanda rebo santa rakande. Ekeri bakata raba. Kere ne kotori kalibaba. Let us look into this book first before we move forward. We know the story of the walls of Jericho, right? <laughs> they were stuck. They were stuck. The enemy always liked to use stone to blockage the children of God. They like to use stones. This time around, they make a very long walls. They use it round against the children of God. In, in chapter 6 of Joshua, let us read verses 1 and 2. It said, Now Jericho was securely shut up because of the children of Israel. None went out and none came in. What a word. Because of the children of Israel. They made this heavy fence. None were able to walk out nor come in. They stagnated them. They made them to be still there. They made them to be stopped. So that there will be no movement. And tell me what can a somebody that is stuck in a place can do. When he cannot go out nor come in. When he cannot go for business and come in. They have seized, st stuck your finance so that you will not be able to move forward. They know that when that finance is break loose, you are going to do miraculously. You are going to do marvelously. And they hold, they stock the money. They stock your finance. They make sure that you don't have one plus one to be two. Ah, ketu ra, kete, re, kete, eh, eh. Nana kotori kalana ndeke se. Ma kotori inana keri alanda ra kotoko soko li kalanda ra. Ma kele kete koromono koso tori kari baba. Now listen to me, brethren. As many of us that are here, even as many that are not able to be present before, that has ever been to this platform, eh, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, eh, as we pray this prayer, everyone shall break loose, eh, in the name of Jesus Christ, eh, whosoever, whatever, that has been stalking anybody from, from, from coming into his rest, eh, from coming into his purposes, eh, from bringing out that which God has assigned him or her to do, that is making him not to do it just because of finance. Eh? We break that barrier. We break that barrier. We break that barrier. In the name of Jesus Christ, we command that barrier to bow right now. Any power upholding eh? finances of anyone, eh? I command that power. I say, lose your hold. Eh? I say, lose your hold. Eh? In the mighty name of Jesus, eh? you power of witches and wizards eh? that has been what we be upholding it, upholding it, and arresting it, and catching anybody's money. Oh, Rakata Rebo Santa, Mande Kutaraba Kerebo, you send your money to somebody.
anybody and they use it against you from today in my santa in my reketunda ekete rekete ikala lalande robosonto whosoever has used your money against you as we pray right now angels of wealth angels of wealth go and retrieve that money back to the owner go and retrieve that money back to the owner in the mighty name of Jesus Christ receive back your finances receive back your finances wherever anybody has been locked down there financially I command it break loose I command it break open I command it break loose right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ and that man that woman that has used your money against you oh, okay it's a man that man that has used that money against you as we pray right now since he hates prosperity in finance he hates another man's prosperity in finance we command finance to be his problem we send back poverty to that owner to, to the owner we send back that poverty spirit back to sender back to sender back to sender Mark Santo, receive your freedom receive your financial freedom we reject poverty in this platform. We renounce poverty in this platform. We refuse to beg to eat. We refuse to beg to live. We refuse to, to live in penury. In Jesus' mighty name, when somebody is financially down, little can he do. Very little. He can't do much. He will not be able to do much. They know that finance is very powerful. They know that with finance, you, you will go too well. So they will trap finance. And they will make the person to be struggling. What a wicked word. How can somebody try to help somebody? And we will not take it opposite. They will take it to cover. And we say, you see, he's trying to make my mockery of me. I don't have, so he's not sending me money. Ah, ah, demons are very wicked. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, whosoever that will pay you for evil for good, in goodness will never meet that person until they repent from of their wickedness. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, whosoever is paying you evil for good, ah, good will be very far away from that person until that person realizes that it is good to be good. You that has done good to somebody, the Lord God Almighty will increase you to continue to do good. You will never lack anything good. You will never lack anything good. In the mighty name of Jesus, glory to glory. Our finance will never be your problem anymore. You will never lack, oh Lord. Father Lord, let it be so. Let it be so. Let it be so. In the name of Jesus. Ah, rekete kete, yes, mara kotorobo. Don't mind me. If I want to be calling names, I will be calling names. But I'm, I'm, I don't want to be doing that right now. But I know when God says, say it, I will say it. Ah, that person, that person, God said you are a rich woman. You are a rich woman, no? Oh, but the enemies are just very tired. The enemies are trying to hold it back. Eh? They are trying to push you backward. Eh? They are jealous of you, your family already. They are jealous of your, your family already. It's like more or less you are the only person in, your, in abroad. So they are very jealous. But it's the mighty name of Jesus Christ. That their jealousy is a stone. It shall be rolled back. I say roll back. I say roll back. As the Lord roll it back, I pray. Let an angel sit on it. Let angel bury it. Let angel push it backward. It will never come back again. In the name of Jesus. You are going higher. You are making it. Ah, what's the your and nobody has done in your family? That success nobody has ever got in your family. That is your portion. In the mighty name of Jesus. Their jealousy is just for nothing. Their jealousy will do you no harm. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 So shall it be. It is settled in Jesus' mighty name. Ha rekete kerebo. Let me just read that verse 1 and 2 completely. Then we go forward to another. We just have two scriptures more. Hallelujah. He said, now Jericho, 
was securely shut up because of the children of Israel. None went out and none came in. And the Lord said to Joshua, See, I have given Jericho into your hand, its king and the mighty man of value. When the enemy knows you are going to take over position, when the enemy knows that you are a great, a great man, a great woman, they will begin to do any kind of thing to stop you. They will begin to do any kind of thing to stop you. They are not stopping you, they are stopping themselves. They are not stalking you, they are stalking themselves. They cannot stop you. We are unstoppable. They cannot do it anymore because their power has failed them. Their powers has failed them. Their coven will receive fire of destruction. Next time they call your name for evil, they will receive fire in their kingdom. They will receive thunder. Thunder of earthquake will fall upon them. God Almighty will destroy them in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. He said, touch not my anointed and do my prophet no harm. Anybody trying to do you any harm anymore? It shall boomerang. It shall return back to send us. It shall return back to send us. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, you are unstoppable. You are untouchable. In the mighty name of Jesus, when you receive temptation next time, it's for your stepping stone. It's for you to go higher. It's God just wants you to know there is a battle. There is a battle. Stand up, pray, and you will be over, over victorious over them. You will be victorious over them. You will be victorious. Eh? Victory is our portion in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Hallelujah. We are going to see what the word of God says in the book of John, chapter 11, 36, uh, 38 and 39. In the book of John 11, Hallelujah. 38 and 39. Then Jesus again, groaning in himself, came to the tomb. It was a, a cave and a stone lay against it. Jesus said, take away the stone. Martha, the sister of him who was dead, said to him, Lord, by this time there is a, a stench for, the, for he has been dead for four days. Mm. Mm? When I read this place, I said, oh yes. Because no matter the condition, no matter the situation, no matter how long the enemy has been fighting you, when the Lord rises, when the Lord says enough is enough, when you shout to the Lord, when you talk to the Lord, when you cry to the Lord, enough is enough. I want to be out of this talking. I want to get out of this situation. God will showcase himself. The power in the name of Jesus Christ will showcase himself. And you will be alleviated. And you will be victorious. Hey, Makere Bobo, can you imagine? When Jesus got there, they, 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 he said they should roll the stone, but they were saying it has been dead for four days. Ha! Huh, how can I do this again? How can I be like this again? How can I make it again? Look at my age. How can I do this again? I need money. I don't have the money. It's been long I've been trying to get money. It's been long I've been trying to come to do that project. It's been long. The Lord God Almighty is telling us. No matter how long, no matter how far, no matter whatever, any time, it is never too late. It can never be too late. It can never be too late. You may not know how, you may not know when, he will do it again, God will do it again. Eh? God will do it again. No matter the condition, no matter what, no matter, just call on the name of Jesus. Just call on the name of Jesus. Just realize that I've been stuck in this place. And it is not the will of God for we God's children to be stuck in a place. 
it is not the will of God for us to remain stand still. It is not the will of God for us not to move forward. It is the will of the enemies. It is the will of Satan. It is the will of the enemies of goodness. Today, in the mighty name of Jesus, we say no more. No more stalking. I cannot be stuck anymore. Santa. I am moving forward by the power in the name of Jesus Christ. That stone that has been blocking me shall be rolled, shall be rolled away physically, spiritually. That stone that has been stalking me as sickness, I command you to give up. That stone that has been stalking me as shame and disgrace, from today, God's glory shall reign upon me. That's praise, that diabetes, that sugar in the blood, I command that blood, oh, Corobo Santa, I command that blood, receive deliverance. I say, receive your healing, access. Access, access, you are a sickler. Makete Rebo Santa, Mande Rekatorobo Shinarama, Marekete Rekete. I have seen so many testimonies. When God is changing the blood type, God changes the blood type. Make Rekete, receive total deliverance, receive total healing, receive the free infusion of the blood of Christ into your blood. Rekete, be normal now, be normal now. Let it turn. So, eh, eh. Let it turn to eh, eh. in the name of Jesus Christ. Eh. God has not created you to be a sickler. God has not created you. Whatever foundation, foundational play, uh, pattern, eh, family pattern that is working against you. Today, I cut you out of it. Eh. Today, you have no more, more part of that eh, because you believe in Christ. Eh. Freedom has come upon you in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. We are going to the book of Corinthians. Then we can start our prayers. Marekete kerebo santa. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. In the book of Corinthians, chapter 16, verse 9. For a great effective door has opened to me. Great effective door has opened to me. <laughs> when Jesus Christ has overcame, when he has resurrected, when he has delivered the whole world, there was a great effective door to so many souls. To so many souls. Effective door opened to me. And there were many adversaries. The adversary of that stone, if it was not rolled away, hey, Karakatoso, if it was not rolled away, it might be an issue, but God wants to prove himself so strong eh, that we need angels to do some kind of job in our lives. Eh. God wants to show to us eh, that we need earthquake, eh, spiritual earthquake, eh, physical earthquake eh, to descend upon the covens, eh, to descend upon evil altars, eh, to descend upon eh, the shrine, eh, the idols of family household, eh, to descend on them and dismantle them. God wants to demonstrate his power by thunder, by the earthquake, to remove everything that is binding us to one place, that is making us not to move forward. And God Almighty, even though victory has been given to him, he still needs to demonstrate that there are things that need to be uprooted, there are things that need to be prayed against, there are things that need to be moved out of our way. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, we move them out of our way right now. Every blockage is uh, between us uh, and our breakthrough. If not that God is God, uh, then we will be able to make sure that Jesus Christ did not wake up. Uh, they would have been able to make sure that Jesus Christ did not complete his assignment. Uh, that is the way they are still making it. Uh, that people with great star, they are being stuck. They are being stuck because they have put in uh, this stone uh, of financial problem. Uh, they have put in uh, this problem uh, of sickness in the body. Somebody that is sick, uh, how can he function? Uh, he can function but little. We need the grace of God uh, to be able to do what we are we have come to this earth to do. Our purposes uh, is very important uh, because on the last day, God is going to ask you and I, how did we use the gift? Uh, and this is what we are talking about. Uh, every stone uh, that is standing before us, uh, not to be fulfilled, uh, every 
stone uh, that is making us uh, not to move forward, uh, just like the children of Israel, uh, that they were stopped not to possess their possession until that wall fall down flat. Until the wall preventing them from going out and coming in fell down flat. The walls that need to fall down flat in my life, in your life, so shall it be. Every wall that need to fall down flat, unfriendly friends that need to fall down flat, unfriendly friends, we are not saying they should die, yo. they should not mind their business. Evil tongue that are speaking against you, brainwashing your dear destiny helpers against you, we command them there to be tamed. We command their tongue to be tamed. We command them to shut up. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Anything that is trying to stalk us. Any family member trying to stalk us. They will think that they know you too much. I begin to speak against you to your helpers. Soto. If they refuse to repent, eh? ah, oh God, let earthquakes swallow them. Let the ground open and swallow them. Anybody, any man, any woman at all that is against your greatness, eh? I command the ground to swallow them. Spiritual ground, swallow them. Physical ground, swallow them. In the mighty name of Jesus, eh? let them be baptized with shame and disgrace. Let them be baptized with shame and disgrace. Let them go no way. But I tell you, you are we amount of something. You are going higher. You are going greater. In the mighty name of Jesus, those that hate your little upliftment, they will see you going higher. Where they will remain in that stock which they have planned against you. No weapon from the against you shall prosper. Every weapon that from the against you shall be condemned. Every weapon that from the against you shall be destroyed. Ah, in Ephesians chapter 6 verse 12, it said from now henceforth, let no man trouble me. From now henceforth, let no man trouble me. For I bear the mark of Christ. I bear the mark of Christ. Let no man trouble me. I am strong when I am on your shoulder. Raise me up to more than I could be. He raised me up to stand on the mountains. He raised me up to work on a stormy seas. I am strong when I am on your shoulder. Raise me up to more than I could be. The Lord shall raise us up. The Lord shall raise us up above our enemies. Our hands shall be stronger than the hands of our enemies. Our hands shall be stronger than the hands of our enemies. Our children's hands shall be stronger than our enemies' hands. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Promotion is our portion. Overcome us, that is what God has called us. He said we are peculiar people. We are peculiar people. We are overcomers. In the Maraca Sender of Santa Raba. Any power that wants to stop us again, we stop them. Any power that wants to blockage us, we blockage them. When we march forward, eh, the strength of the ego shall be our portion. In the mighty name of Jesus, we shall soar. We shall soar like the ego. Unstoppable power of God eh, shall rest upon us mightily. The courageous spirit in the Holy Ghost eh, shall descend upon our lives. Eh. Ah, we shall manifest. Eh. We shall manifest. Testimony shall be our portion. Eh. Victory shall be our portion. Eh. For the Lord God is on our side. Eh? For the tomb has been opened. Eh? For the tomb has been broke loose eh? by the thunder of the almighty God. Eh? By the earthquake from above. Eh? The angels has pulled back the stone. Eh? And we are out eh? to demonstrate that we, ha we have arised with Jesus Christ. He said we are co-heads with Christ. We are co-heads with Christ. As long as the death could not hold him captive, no death will be able to hold us captive in the name of Jesus Christ. We refuse and we reject premature death. We shall not die in the hands of our enemies. 
Because the Lord God Almighty has risen, our Lord Jesus Christ, he rose from the grave so that he will demonstrate that we cannot die young. He said with long life he will satisfy us. If God Almighty himself has said that with long life he will satisfy we, how can the enemy say no? They cannot say no because when he says yes, it is yes. When he says no, it is no. No, who can battle with the Lord? I say nobody. Nobody can battle with our God. Believe in the Lord and thou shall be saved. Believe that the Almighty God has declared you free. Believe that the Almighty God is by your side. Believe that the Almighty God has given you victory. You are no longer a victim because that grave has been shaken by thunder. That grave has been shaken by earthquake from today even in our sleep any earth, any power that want to trap us down let the earthquake of God quake them let it descend on them vandalize them scatter them destroy them put them to shame and disgrace in the name of Jesus Christ wherever they come together to begin to call your name for evil earthquake of the almighty God descend in their midst let them be confused Confusion eh, in the midst of the enemies, eh, in their coven, eh, earthquake, eh, in their marine world, eh, earthquake, eh, wherever they kept your pictures, eh, wherever they have taken your piece of cloth, oh, earthquake, makata, in the Ramana, Ekorokotokorobo, Shinda Rakete, Kete, Kete, Makata, hey, hallelujah. Hey, Ketura Baba, I am seeing people above their enemy, above their enemy, above their enemy. In the mighty name of Jesus, eh, whosoever hates eh, your goodness, eh, whosoever hates eh, your promotion, eh, they will never be promoted. They will remain in that position. Why you will be promoted? You are going higher. Why they will remain on one spot? Eh, because they are enemy of goodness. They don't love it. Eh. They don't love promotion. So sh they shall remain in that place. Eh. Why you are being promoted in the name of Jesus Christ. Your children, they will be one of the ones that they will be head of. Eh? They will rule and reign in the midst of their mate. Eh? They will rule in their community. They will rule in their country. They will rule internationally. In the name of Jesus Christ. Eh? In the name of Jesus, we have prayed. Amen. We are going to start praying now. Very few prayer because we have been praying along. Glory be to God in the highest. Glory be to God in the highest. Hallelujah. Every stock situation in my life receive divine acceleration. Every stock, every stock, anything that has been stuck in my life receive divine acceleration in the name of Jesus Christ. Pray, pray. Masakala Baba Ndorobo. Pray. Rakata, rakata, rekoto. Ima ramana katerebo shantara baba. In Jesus' mighty name, receive divine acceleration, receive divine speed, receive divine speed. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. Remember to like, share, comment as your finger can carry you. Hallelujah. God bless you. Oh Lord, let every blockage eh, in my life be disblocked henceforth. Every blockage in your life be disblocked eh, as that stone eh, was a blockage. Eh, it was disblocked eh, by that angel. Oh, korobobobobo. Every disblock, every blockage in my life, eh, every blockage in my life, in every area of my life, eh, let it be disblockage. Let it be disblockage. In the name of Jesus, be disblockage. Every blockage in my life, be this blockage in my finances, eh, whatever that is blocking my finances eh, from rising up, eh, from going increase, eh, I command you be this blockage. Eh. Whatever power of sickness in my body, I command you right now be this blockage eh. in the name of Jesus. Pray, 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 pray. Any blockages, eh, whatever pains, eh, whatever sorrow the enemy is bringing to you, whatever shame and disgrace, eh, be this blockage. Eh. I rebuke shame and disgrace. Eh. I reketere, I am a vessel unto honor, not unto. Dishonor. I refuse to be vessel unto dishonor. In the mighty name of Jesus, I am a vessel unto honor. I refuse shame and disgrace. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Every, every overdue next level. 
being hard bound in my life over due next level. You are supposed to be in a level now, but it has been overdue, and you are just being stuck in one place because of that thing, because of this stubborn evil stone that they have put it in your acceleration for promotion. There, you are supposed to be is you are overdue for many things. We are overdue for many things, see. We are overdue for many things, sir. Today we are commanding every overdue next level to begin to manifest. We command every overdue level that we are supposed to have even go and pass beyond there. We are commanding them. We are commanding them to receive divine acceleration. Makatare, pray every overdue level that you are supposed to have passed, eh, that you are supposed to be now, that is not manifesting. Pray, 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 pray. Every overdue level, every overdue level being held bound eh, in my life. It's time. Roll away. Every stone blocking it. Roll away. Every stone blocking at my next level. Roll away. My overdue level that has been blocked by any power, that has been blocked by any witch, that has been blocked by any occultic, that has been blocked by evil dragon. I command you right now. I say roll away. Those that are sitting down, I begin to lay incantation against my next level, not to manifest. Eh? I consume you by fire. I command fire to go into your mouth. Be roasted by fire in the mighty name of Jesus. Eh? Overdue level in my life. Eh? I say move forward by fire. I say move forward by fire. I say move forward by fire in the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus Christ's holy name, we are moving forward. Hallelujah. Whatever shaking that needs to take place in any area of my life, family, company, among my friends, eh, let it be so now. Let it be so now. Let that shaking happen. Let that earthquake take place eh, for me to be liberated. Eh, any, anywhere, any power, any area of my life eh, that needs to receive earthquake eh, for it to be shaking, eh, for me to move to my next level, for me to, to, to excel. Eh, I command that earthquake, descend, descend, descend. Descend, descend, or put them, consume them in the name of Jesus, or put them, Makala Katerebo, Equala Landaraba, in Jesus' mighty name, Amen. Oh Lord, I sign angels of rescue in terrific situation. It is a terrific situation. Lazarus was in terrific situation, he was in the, in the, in the grave, he was dead. If not Jesus Christ that came to his rescue, Lazarus would have rotten and just go like that. We are praying that God will assign angels what we cannot do on our own. The angels shall do it. What we cannot manifest on our own. The power that is holding us bound, that is stronger than us. Oh Lord, assign angels of rescue. Assign angels of rescue in our terrific situation eh, to set us free, to roll away these stones, eh, to roll away this problem, to roll away this, uh, this these powers and principalities eh, to bring down every Goliath eh, that is saying, eh, that is boasting eh, against our next level. Assign angels of war upon our lives eh, in every situation that we cannot handle on our, uh, ourselves. Eh. Angels of war begin to battle, begin to battle our enemies, eh, begin to battle any stumbling block. Eh. Or oh, put them, put them out. Eh. And sit on them. Put them out and sit on them. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Ha, we are going to pray a few more prayers again. In the name of Jesus, I command every stone say, representing obstacle in my life. Be rolled away. Be rolled away by supernatural power. Be rolled away by supernatural power. Be rolled away by supernatural power. We can see in three, four instances where stones are being represented as obstacles. Eh? These spiritual and spiritual stones, eh? we will not know they will be making these spiritual stones eh? in their covenant, in their marine world. Eh? Every, every, we, in the name of Jesus Christ, I command every stone eh? representing obstacle in my life, in your life. Command them 
Commandant to be rolled away. Commandant to be rolled away. Commandant to be rolled away. In the mighty name of Jesus. Eh? Commandant to be rolled away. By supernatural power in the name of Jesus Christ. He eh? said, Reketura Baba. Makerebo Robo Sontorobo. Ah, Rekete. Whatever is laid across my path not to move forward. There are things they will lay it across your path. They can be friend. The enemy can remote friend to your life. The enemy can remain. <laughs> hey, there is something that happened. An experience. See, when you get to a new city, if you are not serious, if you are not strong that very moment, the first people that you will come across, they are the powers and principalities in human form. They are the ones that will embrace you, that will welcome you first. And when they welcome you first, they are the ones that will tell the other demons, they will say, this person is here now. They will be taking command from the powers of darkness. You will think that they are your friend. They will do it so that they, are, they will now use those, that person against that person mightily. Now you will not say, where am I? Where did I come to this place? Oh, yes. They are agents of Satan. So when you get to a new city that you don't know people before, what you need to do is to be extremely careful. Be very careful. Before you make any friend, ask the Holy Ghost. Tell the Holy Ghost to reveal this person to you. Who is this person? Because they can be the angels, the, the, the demons, the agents in that city. They, when they know that you are coming, they will set them forward. I, I, it happened to me. And I said, why? Why will I meet this person first? And this person is the person that, in fact, in that city, is the person that did so many things. And it has already happened. What will you do? That is why we need to be careful. Hallelujah. Whatever is laid across my path, not to move forward, be rolled away. By the mighty name of Jesus. Be rolled away. Whether it be friend, whether it be bad business, whether it be bad communication, be rolled away. Be rolled away in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name. Now we are going to see. We are going to pray this last prayer. Whatever God, my creator, has not given to me, be held and oppose my enemies. I take it back by fire. I take it back by fire. Whatever God, my creator, has given to me that is in the hand of the enemies, hey, that one, eh? whatever God has given to you that the enemy has stolen from you, you don't understand it. There are things that God has given to us. It's like our glory. Many people might, might have tempered with their glory. You that is having ministry, Maybe you're supposed to have 1,000 members. The enemy has succeeded in, in, in brainwashing half of them. God has given you your sheep and they have divided it. God has given you business. And because you explain to your friend, they will go ahead of you. They will go ahead of you and start that business. I am telling you. God has given you a dream. And because you are not careful enough, you tell somebody that is possessed, that business will never manifest. Let me tell you, we need to pray. We need to be very careful with who we speak with. We need to be very careful with who we relate to. Santa, what is it that God has given to you that the enemy is sitting on? What is it that God has given to you that the enemy is operating on? What is that thing in your glory that the enemy has taken away? Today we take it back. Pray that anything about my glory that the enemy has tempered with, I recover it. I recover it. Let it there be restoration upon my glory today. Let it there be restoration upon my glory, upon my gifts, in the name of Jesus, upon my plans, upon my dreams, whatever the enemy has succeeded, taken away from me, I recover them. I recover in the name of Jesus, Makerebobo, and Nemosella, Ikatarabas and Darabobo, anybody that has tempered with my glory, anybody that has taken what belongs to me, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I retrieve them back. I retrieve them back. Come back 
to me. You, my glory, come back to me. My star, come back to me. My goodness, come back to me. In the name of Jesus, say, Those that are supposed to surround me as helpers eh, that has been taken away by evil tongue, eh, I command them to begin to find me, to begin to locate me, to begin to, re to, to come back to me. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, in Jesus' mighty name, I will draw back all that belongs to me, spiritually, physically, in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. We are going to make this last prayer. I can't be stuck. I move forward by fire. I cannot be stuck. You know when somebody is stuck? It's like somebody, like uh, the other day I saw a video, the child was just trying to pass. And he hooked in between the gates. I cannot be stuck. I move forward by fire. I cannot be stuck. I move forward by fire. My children cannot be stuck. We move forward by fire. My family cannot be stuck. We move forward by fire. In the mighty name of Jesus, my power, my glory, anything concerning me that God Almighty has put into me cannot be stuck for any reason. We move forward by fire. You move forward by fire. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, eh? Sister Carol, Minister Carol, woman of God, you move forward by fire. You move forward by fire. You shall reign over your enemies. Eh? You shall reign over your enemies. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, eh? Prophet Esabli the man, eh? ah, you will move forward by fire. You are making it in life. Eh? You shall rule and reign. Eh? You shall complete your assignment on earth. Eh? Premature death is not your portion. Eh? You move forward by fire. Your family moves forward by fire. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Eh? Ah, sister, I told her. Agui, God, God Almighty, we move you forward by fire. No power will limit you. No power will limit your children. In the mighty name of Jesus, those that are saying, aha, aha, it will be aha, aha upon them. In shame and disgrace, shame and disgrace will never locate you. It will never locate your household. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, that one thing that you are crying for, hold your peace for the Lord God is on your side. In the name of Jesus Christ, Santa Brother Godwin Eze, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, uh, you are moving forward by fire. You are moving forward by fire. All whatever you have not conquered in life, you shall conquer them. Victory is your portion. Victory is your portion. Victory is your portion. You are a great man. So shall it be. Nothing can stop you. You are unstoppable. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Uh, amen and amen. And as many that has rose. Off, eh? As many that has rolled off, eh? you are moving forward by fire. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, no weapon formed against you shall prosper. Ah, Floxy, you are moving forward by fire. Me, woman of God, you are moving forward by fire. And as many that has visited this temple, in the mighty name of Jesus, this tabernacle, it shall favor you. The almighty God eh, will move you forward by fire. In the mighty name of Jesus, we move you forward. Eh? Anything I want to blockage you. Earthquake shall arise uh, and destroy it. Uh, angels of God will roll away that stone uh, that is before you not to move forward. Uh, in the name of Jesus Christ. God bless you, children of God. We are all children of God. God bless you, my lovely brothers and sisters. Uncle uh, God, God bless you, sir. You are lifted. You are lifted in Jesus' name. Pastor Bayomi Kalisto, you are lifted. God bless you. God bless you. Marka Terebo Santa. God bless you. Please, if you, have, if you have not followed the page, do well to follow the page. And God will bless you, bless us mightily. This is the week. This is the week. Um, Easter. Next week is Easter. Easter already. And this Easter period, the resurrection of Christ. Why did Jesus Christ came to the earth? Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Man of God, man of God, Macaulay, Sunday, Uwanchuku, Uwanchuku, Uwanchuku in Jesus' name. 
God bless you, sir. God bless you for joining us today. The Almighty God will lift you higher. The Almighty God will bless you. You shall see no evil, home and abroad. You have been protected. The Lord God Almighty will pour fresh oil upon your life to fulfill as many assignments you are here on earth to do. You shall be, they shall be fulfilled in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Hallelujah. We are blessed. So this, this Easter period, the resurrection of Christ, because it's the resurrection of Christ, we are rising with him. We are rising with him in another dimension. Everything in us, everything about us is arising, it's taking another shape. It will take another different kind of shape and people will be wondering, why is this person so joyful? Why is this person so happy? According to what somebody told me, when things were just going rough and rough, and they say, ah, you, you're still carrying Bible. I just look at the person and I smile. Why? Because he doesn't know. They don't know that there is no other God. Only Jesus can save. Only Jesus that we serve can save. Hallelujah. And the Lord God Almighty, in this season, he will roll away Every stone, every stone, thunder, earthquake, we take them out of our way in Jesus' name. Sister Eki Patrick, God bless you. God bless you. I know today everybody is busy. You are welcome. Anyway, you can still listen to the video. You will still partake of the blessings. Hallelujah. Love you. Love everyone. God bless you. Love you so much. God bless. So we meet again. Maybe during the week, I don't know when I just talk like that, I can't do it. I don't know why God forbid but so by the grace of God, we meet again. When you see anytime you see notification, please do where to join. Do where to join. Do where to join. I love you. I love you so much. God bless you. You are lifted in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Hallelujah.